What's up, my dudes? Welcome back to the program. Today, we're going to crack open some Matchbox cars, and all of them have moving parts, so no more delay. Let's jump right into the video. We're going to start with this Subaru Brat. Looks like they named it after my wife. Very, very cool. Love this vehicle. I actually had a friend back in high school who was a BMX guy, and he jumped his Brat. He put a ramp there and a ramp on the back, and he jumped over it. It was awesome. Anyway, let's go ahead and crack this open. All right, and there it is out of the package, looking super awesome. So it's got some really cool blue metallic paint, side view mirrors as usual, because Matchbox is awesome. No headlight detail, unfortunately, or tail lights. So maybe they're not that awesome. Very plasticky base, but there you go. I like the wheels on this vehicle. They look really good. And of course the hood opens. And that's where all of our paint details are. Well, I mean, oh, wait, wait, what? Is that a spare tire? I don't know much about this vehicle. Other than it's super quirky and I love it. All right, we're gonna put it right there. All right, next one up, we're gonna do this one right here. 2019 Ram Ambulance. And there we go. It is out of the package. We have set it free. And again, side view mirrors, I love that. Very sensible wheels for this type of machine. And check it out, headlight details, as well as some emergency lights as well. Matchbox Fire Department from El Segundo. Very cool. Got some other paint details up there, which are nice. And I'm guessing this is what opens. Let's see. There we go. Got one. And now we've got two. There we go. Got both doors open. Let's see if there's anything in there we can see. No dead bodies. No cadavers. Which is good for the kitties. Anyway, here's the base right there. Ram Ambulance. And this thing is pretty darn cool. I dig that one a lot. Very cool. Awesome. All right, put it there next to the brat. Let's see. Next one up. Let's do this one, Mercedes-Benz Unimog, U5023, uh, is a police Unimog, and it looks pretty awesome. Let's get to cracking. All right, and there it is, out of that terrible Matchbox packaging. I really hate those new cards. But anyway, there it is, very appropriate black wheels, which look cool. Got, let's see, what is that? Uh, some kind of hydrant and a pickaxe and a um, teething ring. And what's going on here? Why is that moving like that? Look at that. What is, uh, what is the purpose? Speaking of, also, what opens? Let's see. What am I missing? What is the moving part? It's not the doors. Oh, we got a blacked out windshield. That's cool. Get a ticket for that where I live. So I guess that is it. That's the moving part. It does this for some reason. Maybe to get over rocky terrain? I don't know. Mm. No tail lights, no headlights. I can't really recommend this one. The moving feature is pretty stupid and there's not much going on, but there's that one. All right, and the last matchbox we got is this one right here. I thought this one was really cool. And I found all of these on the peg, by the way. I don't really like to pay resellers and scalpers anymore online. So if I don't find it on the peg, I typically don't buy it. Unless it's some crazy exclusive or what car I really want, which does happen from time to time. But anyway, let's go ahead and crack this one out of its shell and set it free. All right, there we go. It's out of that terrible matchbox blister thing. And there's the part that opens. See some luggage back there. And check it out, tail lights. We got a uh, license plate, side view mirrors and headlights. So quality wise, this one, is definitely the best of the bunch. And also it's that Tiffany blue, which I love. Some nice white wheels. I think these are the same ones as the Brat. Looks to be the case. But again, yeah, look at those headlights, grill, very nice. Tail lights, very detailed. Dig that one, very cool. 
yeah, definitely the best car out of that four car group. But all right, you guys, that was the video. Thank you very much for chilling with me on this Sunday afternoon. I think next week I'm gonna crack up with some M2 machines, including this one right here. So stay tuned for that. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll catch you dudes next time. Ain't no